In today's video, we're going to take a look at some add-ons by Sergey Tyapkin that can help you with your work inside Blender, from managing UVs, modeling bevels, adding navigation windows, managing groups, and other stuff. But before we continue, I want to remind you guys that we are going through the Black Friday to Cyber Monday sale. So this is a great opportunity to get yourself some of the best add-ons, courses, shaders, you name it. Especially on the Blender market, because they are having a big discount of up to 30%. And other developers, even more than that. And if you don't know where to start, I have in the description of this video a list of the top Blender add-ons and courses that you will ever need. Without further ado, let's jump right into the video. Let's start with Zen Barbecue. An animal made with the sole purpose of creating bevels. So if you ever worked with hard surface models, you know if you want to get good and smooth results, you will have to add a subdivision and bevel modifiers, which can cause more problems if you have a complex model. Those problems can be dealt with one by one, but the process will take a long time depending on the complexity of the model. But the Zen Barbecue add-on offers some interesting features to deal with those problems. You can assign a custom radius to any selected loop and you can do that fast with the help of the pie menu without doing it manually for each loop in the bevel modifier tab. And the process is non-destructive and it stores data in mesh data so it won't interfere with the materials. The add-on is quite simple as you can see and it is one of those add-ons which is designed for speed and also helps you be more productive when it comes to modeling. Another add-on from this developer is called Zen UV, which is one of the most useful add-ons when it comes to UV unwrapping. As the name suggests, this add-on focuses on UV editing, offering a range of features to simplify and optimize the process. So it can automatically detect sharp edges, refine quads, and optimize UV maps, taking care of the most annoying aspects of UV work. One of the most useful features is the Z Unwrap, which maps UV islands in trims by matching area and aspect ratio. And it offers a pie menu with which you can quickly access essential tools to isolate islands, qualify edges, and more. Also, the ability to automatically stack UVs is a game changer for saving time and space. Generally speaking, Zen UV offers so many features and listing them all in this video will take a lot of time. So I invite you to check it out because it is one of the best add-ons in this field. The next add-on is called Zendark, which is made to make navigation between Blender windows easier. So it is basically a dock that will appear in the bottom right of the active areas. And the dock acts as a controller for windows inside Blender. It can maximize and restore areas, close or minimize them, and you can also add custom buttons to what actions or panels you will find yourself always using. The dock is generally speaking extremely customizable, and it can be a good addition and replacement to Blender's non-existent Windows controls. The next add-on is also very useful, especially for managing objects and scenes, and it is called Zensats. The add-on is basically an upgraded version of the collection systems inside Blender. It features smart selection and grouping settings, as well as options to show each different collection object with different colors in the viewport. And the add-on works with a pie menu like all the other Zen add-ons. The controls, generally speaking, are fast and easy to use, so anyone can just pick it up and start immediately organizing their scenes. And aside from all the features and ease of use, the add-on deals with a problem a lot of people have, and that is organization. So the add-on makes it easier whether you have a messy scene or you are one of the guys who have a highly optimized scene, this add-on can generally help a lot. But you can try it for yourself and see. Another add-on from this developer is called Checker. The add-on originally was part of Zen UV. So if you have Zen UV, you already have the add-on and what it has to offer. To put it simply, it is just a useful tool to check the state of the UVs more easily. It applies a checker texture to the model so you can check for any problems in the UVs. And the add-on uses a node-based system and has some nice features like a resolution filter to filter textures by resolution and a square and rectangular format. This is actually a nice add-on. Also, it is really simple because this process is something you have to do either way, whether it be using this add-on or manually using Blender. 
because you don't want to create UVs that look distorted and out of place. And there you have it guys. If you are interested in these add-ons, you will find all the necessary links in the description. I hope you guys found this video useful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.